Sunday, December 8th, 2019, day one, I need to find a studio. Now, I'm on my way to Interaxis right now just to start doing some work on uh, the large format fridge that I have, the X5 with my buddy Ad. Um, but as I mentioned in the interview just a second ago, um, what, what I'm looking to do is to find myself a studio. Um, not that I don't like Interaxis, it's a great uh, space to work with people, and I'm going to definitely hang on to it and stay there as a member um, for the community and to have fun with people. Um, but I just need more space to make some noise, um, make a mess, and to build my own things. Um, so, yeah, that's what this will be. It's going to be a journal trying to find that space and to. Go around this truck. And, nope. Uh, try to find that space and make it. Uh, so hopefully we can find a space. I will use it later on this week on Friday, and hopefully that's going to work out. Um, but uh, I don't know. Hopefully that'll be it. Um, so in the next couple of videos, I'll talk to you guys as well about uh, what I've been doing to find spaces, uh, how I've been budgeting that kind of stuff. So. Uh, All right, I'm at Interaxis now. Um, so I realized that the audio was really shitty um, outside. I thought my headphones would actually properly pair with uh, my old phone. I'm using my old phone because I found my new phone is a little too heavy for the, the stabilizer gimbal. Uh, so I'm using my old phone with an older camera, but I really don't care because you just gotta make do with what you got. Um, and I realized the uh, earbuds don't uh, work with the older version of the iPhone, so uh, I'm gonna have to find myself a new uh, recording method. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, also, sorry about the sunglasses. Um, it's kind of bright, not really, but yeah, I'm gonna wear my, put on my glasses in just a second. Um, so, but I wanted to apologize about the audio. Love that. So I just finished up with Adam on uh, working working on the FT5 right now. Uh, we're a bit of a we're at a bit of a standstill now. So um, we replaced the board, um, the motherboard, to see if that was a problem. Um, I'm not entirely sure if that's the case because we are well. A few things went wrong. So when we replaced all the wiring, one of the um, cables that actually goes to the fans, the, the cooling fans, actually popped out. And um, only after Adam left did I find out that. Uh, the crimps actually gave out, so I actually have to recrimp that. I don't have any more 14 gauge um, uh, crimper, um, sorry, uh, spade connectors. So I have to get uh, get a new of those. So that's that's one issue. So spade connectors, 14 gauge, one thing. Uh, next thing, the X axis. It's just not moving well. I don't understand why. Um, so we're going to test it with wiring, existing wiring that I have, existing wiring looms. Uh, and connectors, so I'm going to try that out and see if that works out. If that is the case, then we're good. Um, then it's, we know it's wiring, that's the problem. So maybe I don't want to buy anything until we know it's wiring is an issue. Um, but at the same time, we also have to start um, fixing up the wiring anyways. I did a shitty job wiring before, so um, yeah, gotta work on that. Um, so that's one thing. Um, but it still doesn't solve our problem. We are not sure what's going on with the x-axis and why it's creating such a weird sound. So if it's the wiring, great, we're done. That's great. We'll replace the separate drivers with uh, 2208s uh, that I have, TMC 2208s, which I just got. So that's, that'll be great. And that'll make it running smoothly. And then we can move on from there. Um, I have a whole bunch of other things that I need to fix on this. So wiring is one thing we need to fix. Um, I have to figure out how we're going to manage the wiring on this whole thing because right now it's just not making sense. So I'm going to have to do some sketches, sit with Adam, see what he thinks, um, how we're going to do it, what's the best uh, commercial breakout board connectors and that kind of stuff that we can actually use. I don't know. This is kind of not demotivating, but like uh, so many things to think about, and I feel like I'm back to where I was. A year and a half ago with this project trying to figure out what to do with it and I just I'm I'm at a standstill I don't want to be spending a ton of money testing things out but I also know that I have to test things out to figure it out and to come up with a better solution and uh, I guess I gotta just bite the bullet but 
buy some buy some stuff and test it. Um, so far, we've been going with a really janky setup, and I haven't cut a lot of wires on the hot end uh, end of things, just to allow for more uh, room to work with um, later on if we do need to add more connectors. Yeah, all that to say, no further along.